Welcome back everybody and another edition of Plane Talk. This is going to be a real quick one. When you set your chip breaker, you want it close enough so that it does its job, but you want it far enough back so that you get these shavings jumping up out of the plane. See that? Where it's almost straight. If you set your chip breaker too tight, you'll get shavings. Whoops, we lost that one. Let's make another. You'll get shavings like this. See that? How they're accordioned up, bunched up. Now it's too tight for a friendly wood like this tulip poplar. This wood will behave with just about any plane. Okay? It'll cut beautifully with just about any plane. In fact, a plane even without a chip breaker, like this little block plane, it'll work. It'll give you a, a decent shaving. Okay? But, woods like curly maple, tiger maple, some of the different uh, quartered oaks where you have grain running in every different direction. The tighter chip breaker, now this one is the one that's not tight. See that? tough to keep a tear out free surface. You take the one with the tight chip breaker you see it's all bunched up. It does get harder to push. There we go. There's a nice shape. There we go. See that? See that? <clears throat> That means that you're breaking the chips early and you're getting a nice tear out free surface. Okay? So for something like curly maple and other cranky woods, you want a tighter fit chip breaker. So a lot of times people say, how close? Well, you take a shaving, if the shaving curls right up over itself, the whole length, your chip breaker is not working as effectively. So bring it forward a little bit. If it's bunching up really tight like that and you're getting those curls that look like an accordion, you might want to back it up a little bit. So that's it for this. Next time around, we're going to tinker with this live oak. Uh, one of our friends sent this over because no matter what he did, he was getting tear out. We'll play with that next time round. So that's it for now. Head out to your shop and go make some shavings. Walter out. <laughs>